Robert E. Cremo III is apparently who they're looking for in the shooter. I was able to obtain some information on Robert E. Cremo. And I'd have to say thank you to Fanny, Fanny Homesteader. She actually uh, put me on to this. Um, Facebook went down quick. His YouTube channel went down quick. I was able to grab everything on YouTube. And uh, he does look like a disturbed individual. It's too bad they didn't catch this guy ahead of time. Let's um, also mention the other shootings that happened this weekend that they're not talking about in Chi-Town. Um, they're only focusing on this actual situation. Uh, the politicians are keeping it hush-hush. There was actually 50 people wounded and 12 people killed in Chicago this weekend. And they're not even talking about it. But this guy doesn't look all there. I don't even, is he in jail here? I don't know. So if I go back... Maybe he lives by himself, not with his parents, because he is like, I think they said 22. Seems to have his face tattooed up. He was trying to be some type of rapper. I mean, he's not very good from the from what I was listening to. He really wasn't that good at all. I have the videos actually muted because... It would probably get flagged. He seems pretty decent with his camera work, though, doesn't he? He was almost like playing a very depressing song with this uh, particular video is what he was doing. This one here, he was just dancing around. He's obviously bought some special styled clothes in this one. And while I'm actually making this video, he's actually on the run right now. They're trying to find him. He was actually at the airport in this video, and he was taking video of who? Who knows? Is it the president? I don't know. But he was taking video of somebody here, is what he was doing. And it's almost like he was trying to make a rap video with this and he'd gotten access to a classroom someplace. So, and it looks like a very small classroom where he could actually make this so-called video of, of his rap song. But they're currently looking for this guy and they're uh, looking hard for him. I mean, just when I do searches on the internet, they are moving quick and fast. They know the car he's driving. They know his name. Um, there is an archive out there of uh, on Google of all this information. It's still there. It hasn't been deleted yet, but I'm sure it's not going to take long. So... Somebody's behind that camera. Now, who's behind that camera? I don't know. That newspaper said... If I go back... All's well slain in jail is what that newspaper says in the back. I don't know if that symbol is to basically look like a Nazi symbol I don't know I don't I don't know what this symbol means do you know hit me in the comment section obviously that's to represent blood I know it's wrong with these people man definitely some major uh, mental issues that's for sure So 
I wonder how long he's going to hide for. And he's really not that good of a rapper. He really doesn't sound that good at all. He does a lot of the out and in shots when he does his um, videos and stuff like that. His YouTube channel was up for maybe, I don't know, from the time um, Fanny let me know, it was up for maybe 30 minutes and then it actually went down. Is what ended up happening. If you'd like um, copies of these videos and these photos, go to the About section on YouTube, send me an email. It'll list it there under my About section. And uh, I'll send you a link where this is on the Google Drive and you can download it if that's what you want. So, Robert E. Cremo 3. He's on the run. And they're saying he's the killer. And, uh, this is who they're looking for. They say, if you see this guy, do not approach him. He's apparently dangerous. And basically, he's lost it. So be safe out there, guys. Catch you on the next one.